hi guys it's yay here and welcome back to the channel coupon I'm with yay today's video or this video is day two of the five off of 25 dollar general purchase i wanted to go back today just to kind of test a theory so yesterday's haul was supposed to be a five off of 25 and I was told by the one of the managers in the building that you could actually use the three off of 15 with that. Um, but last night in uh, last night's video, I remember saying that, you know, it just didn't add up right. So I went back in with my receipt and I tested the theory. And you guys, you cannot use that three off of 15 with the five off of 25. It will only take one of those coupons and it kicks off the other one and it takes the lower value actually so um i did three transactions today one at one dollar general location that's this one over here and then i had my daughter with me so we went to another dollar general and we actually did our five off of 25 in two separate transactions um so i'm gonna go through you guys go through with you guys the transactions that we did um, and kind of show you or share with you guys why those two coupons will not work together. So we went back to the same Dollar General that we went to yesterday. Excuse the haul over here. That's a, a different haul. So excuse that mess there. But anyway, so we went back to the same Dollar General that we were at last night. And I kind of did the same um, products. Only I didn't get the Dove bars of soap and I only got one of the St. Ives body washes well they only had one so four of the Tide Pods 16 count these are on sale for $3.95 I picked up two more of the Tresemme Expert shampoo and conditioner here and then I decided to go ahead and pick up two of these uh, Vaseline lotions this is the 10 ounce bottle and these are $3.50 so I picked up two of those and then again with the one St. Ives body wash. This St. Ives body wash is on price break for $2 and there is a $150 off of one insert coupon on that. There's a $2 off of one insert coupon on the um, Vaseline lotion and then there is a buy one get one coupon on the Tresemme and I believe all of these coupons can be found in the let me see I got my notes from yesterday here it's a red plum the 514 red plum on the Tresemme Vaseline and the St. Ives and then the Tide Pods those were printable coupons for $2 off of one from coupons.com so you guys I'm going to show you guys my receipt so I did it the same way I did yesterday. I entered my phone number in thinking that I would be able to use the five off of 25. So I punched my phone number in and then I handed her the three off of 15 uh, from taking the survey coupon. And then I handed her my manufacturer coupons. So after going to the car, I realized after adding things up that it only took off the three off of 15. And then when I checked my app, I noticed that the five off of 25 was still there. So instead of taking everything back and you know returning everything and trying to get my coupons back and all that, I just decided that I would take a loss because this is still a good deal, guys. It's still a good deal. So my total out of pocket before tax was $13.30 for nine products. So that's still a really good deal even if you only have the three off of 15. So Thirteen thirty for nine products makes each each product just a dollar and forty seven cents there. So I even looked at this because this weekend they're gonna have another five off of twenty five, and it actually states on here, guys. I'm I'm kind of new to couponing at Dollar General, so it says that this coupon cannot be combined with any other Dollar General two dollars off, three dollars off, and five dollars off store coupon. So it actually says on there that you can't use it with any other coupons so i'm not sure if there are other people you know getting it and maybe it's a glitch in the system or something but it is not working for me so moving on to the second transaction at the next dollar general we have the um sun triple clean laundry detergent there in the back that is 100 
think it's 100 loads. 100 loads. So I picked up one of that. I got two more of the St. Ives body wash. Two more of the Tresemme. Now this is a different one. Botanic. Nourish and replenish. Picked up two more Vaseline lotions. That's the Coco Radiant. I got two more Sunny D. 40 ounces or more free. That's a dollar. So if they have those, you want to get that one. And then I found in my inserts a coupon on this. So I kind of scoped the aisle for this product. This is the Noxzema Twin Blade Razors here. So the Sun Laundry Detergent in the back is $3.95. And then there's a digital coupon that you want to clip. And then again, we use the BOGO on the Tresemme. We use the $1.50 on the St. Ives. We use the $2 off on the Vaseline. And then we use the 40 cents off on the Sunny D. And then this coupon is a $2 off any one. These are $2.50. So then I typed in my phone number here and it did adjust. It did the five off of 25. My total before coupons on this transaction was $29.45. After coupons before tax was $8.72. So $8.72 for all 10 products or just 87 cents each in that particular transaction. Alrighty. So then in the last transaction, this is the one that I had my daughter do. Um, she's only eight, but she's kind of learning how to count money and learning couponing with mom, right? So her transaction was the same, only we got um, this eight count of bar of soap um, on the zest here. So these are $3.50, and there is an insert coupon for $0.50 cents off of, a, I think it's a six count or larger. I'm not sure which insert that's in. But same coupons here. You want to do the digital on the Sun uh, laundry detergent in the back. The BOGO on the Tresemme. Two of the St. Ives for $1.50 off of one. Two on the Vaseline for $2 off of one. And then uh, two of the 40 cents off of any Sunny D 16 ounce or larger on those. And then that one 50 cents off of there. So my total before coupons was $30.45. Typed in my a husband my husband's phone number, um, which took off the five off of twenty five. Handed the cashier my manufacturer coupons, which I have fourteen dollars and thirty cents in manufacturer coupons. My total before taxes here was eleven dollars and fifteen cents for all ten products you see in transaction three. So that means that each product was just a dollar and eleven cents there for everything you see here. So just a reminder, if you're going to be taking those surveys, just do the three off of 15 separately. And then when you have those five off of 25 on Saturday or whatever days it is that they do, hey, just do those separately just to, you know, kind of uh, omit from you guys having to uh, take a loss anywhere. Um, so that completes this haul guys it's yay um and thank you guys for watching if you like this video go ahead and hit that thumbs up if you are new to my channel go ahead and hit that subscribe button so that i can help you guys save in the future um it seems like you guys really like the dollar general haul so i'm going to try and continue to do those hauls for you guys um i don't live well i do live close to one but you guys know that i will not be shopping at the one that's in my town so I kind of have to drive a ways to get to a Dollar General location. Um, so I like to go big, guys. If I got to drive out and, wait and do gas and everything, my hauls are going to be big. So I'm not going to be doing things like, you know, zero out of pocket or, you know, things like that unless I can. Um, but I like to get more products for each trip that I make. So I hope you guys like this video. And hey, I hope to see you guys in my next one. Thank you for watching.